Hey you guys, welcome back to another episode of Vlogmas. You're watching Miss Bond TV. This is gonna be kind of a really chill sort of episode because I am coming down off of a really weird kind of unclassified cold. I've never felt this kind of cold before. Like it's all in my chest, it's all up in here. And I have a headache and it's all up in here. It's just like really weird. And it's made my voice like super deep and raspy, like more so than usual. So I've just been kind of in the house all day. I took a break with Vlogmas. <clears throat> yesterday i didn't really um film any content or show anything i wasn't really on social media i just was kind of taking it easy because i don't feel good but i did take some dayquil and drinking tea and taking ginger in my tea and lemon and trying to get some rest haven't really been able to just because <sighs> yeah so <laughs> Why is she diving off of that thing? Anyway, y'all, I've been really just trying to struggle to still be a mom and still, you know, do what I have to do as far as my work and take care of myself. So I just took a day to kind of rest. I feel a little bit better, but you know. Yeah, yeah. So I figured I'd get some laundry done, is what you see here, and just put everything away, get organized. Might as well. I mean, as a mom, ain't no days off, really. Like, you can be sick all you want. You better take some day quail, girl, which is what I took last night. It's like Ann's favorite thing to, like, sit in one of these chairs and, like, watch TV up in here. So I get it but she has a hard time sitting still and not jumping on the thing like it's a trampoline. She's already thrown the pillows on the floor. Okay, I can deal with that. But what is going on here? Have a seat, hun. See, all of this right here. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this, Anne? And then if the chair falls back, she's gonna hurt herself. No, no, you need to sit. Sit down, hun. She's such a busybody. Just gotta constantly be moving. And then has the nerve to not want to really sleep a whole lot. You should be good and tired every time you lay down. Anyway, I need to do her hair. I hope I have time to do it tonight, but these twists have been in for a few days now. Uh, we need to wash, condition, and do some different um, braids or something. Braids or twists. One of my subscribers has suggested that we do twists, but we start at the root with um, like a plait braid, like a cornrow type of thing, and then just twist it down. And I'm thinking, look at her trying to stop me from touching her hair. Let me go. Let me go. Give me this. G -g Give me this. <laughs> but we might give that a try just to see if it'll help them to last longer and stay less frizz frizzy at the root. As I'm doing my laundry, I'm always just noticing like that I always have more like pajamas and loungewear kind of stuff, sporty wear, dirty than anything else because it's all I pretty much wear. So my laundry is usually pretty easy to do because everything is going like in the same drawers because I keep everything organized by like category. So all pajamas in one drawer, all of my loungewear stuff that I could kind of wear to the grocery store-ish for running errands but not really trying to be cute pile. Then I have like my t-shirts in another pile, uh, my sweaters and kind of bulkier sport wear in another pile. Like I just have everything categorized pretty good. So usually it's quite easy to put everything away. The part that takes forever is the hanging up of everything. See, I don't really be making this stuff up. Now she took the whole pillow out of the chair and, and threw it over here. She's, she's removed the entire pillow out of this chair so that she can jump a little bit better. I don't know what's going on here, but, and you are doing the most, hun. <laughs> Another way I make things easy on myself when putting away my laundry is that, for example, with my pajamas, if I have like a set, like I have this little Christmas set here that comes with the top and the leggings, I'll put, I'll fold them and put them together in the drawer. So like when I'm getting ready for bed and I go in my drawer, I can easily find the set. Like I don't have to be like looking for one piece or the other if I want to wear it together. Cause to me that sometimes that's more comfy to wear the set, you know, together like it came. Like this set, this is another Christmas set. Like it's in there together. So I won't have to be like, you know, it's like less stress when I'm trying to find my pajamas when it's time to go to bed.
Anne's next mission is to bring some of these little wooden toys, these little puzzle pieces, into here. So she's on a mission to run in there, grab as many as she can, run back in here, and start piling them up on this chair. Here she comes with another batch. And she'll do like little self-appointed tasks like this randomly throughout the day where she'll like pile up her toys in a particular area. Sometimes she'll do stuffed toys. Sometimes she'll do her puzzle pieces like her uh, Melissa and Doug puzzle pieces. This is just whatever she feels like is important at the moment. And she decides each time. It's like always her preference. <sighs> and so I just, you know, you can't stop her once she starts. So I'll just let her do it and I'll just, you know, help her put it back afterwards. Have fun, hon. Cause it's like she's either doing this or she's gonna be bothering me, so. Last item is this neutral pinkish kind of sweater. So usually I try to color coordinate a little bit. I'll just slide it right in there. So then it's easy to find it when I'm looking for it. And yep, this was in the laundry because I'd be washing this hat like once a week. <laughs> and it's, it does pretty well in the wash. I mean, it's got that soft brim to it and everything. So it can it can go in with the socks and t-shirts. So I wash this when I wash my workout clothing. Ann's trying to get into this Llama Llama show. Y'all, this company reached out to me. Whoever represents them, they reached out to me and was trying to get me to you know, promote it on my Instagram and stuff involving Ann. But I was like, my daughter has never watched this. So I was like, I don't know if this is a good fit. I don't do un inauthentic stuff. So I told him no. She's gonna start watching it. And we're gonna see if she likes it. Let's see if you like it. Feels good to be all done. I'm just gonna get my wireless vacuum in and sweep up here because you know when you do laundry sometimes it'd be like lint and stuff everywhere. So I'm gonna get all this up. Just wanted to quickly show you all how I organized my bras and panties, kind of undergarments like this. Panties and stuff over here, bras over here. And then socks. I like to keep them mated, right? So you can just easily grab and put on shapewear and tights, and then some of my dust bags that I just have no place else to put. Okay, so I finally unboxed the Studio wireless headphones just to try them out and see how they are. I actually just did a test run on my computer to see what the voiceover would sound like and it sounds really good because the Beats that I had, I had some Beats wireless, Studio Beats, whatever they call them, and they, I've had them for many, many years and they just started to just kind of hum, like they don't really, the microphone doesn't record as great. So these, this is this was perfect timing. Now this was a PR package, I mentioned it in a couple vlogs ago. The company asked me if I wanted to try these and I said okay, um, and then I would share the experience with you guys. So they are wireless headphones. They have 24 hour play time, it's collapsible design, so I mean, you can kind of just like break it down and fold it up. Kind of just like, you know, just like the beats. Okay, so here's what it comes with. It comes with a charger for that wireless action, but I'll probably just be plugging them in directly, which is just a USB cable. And knock it off, it's just a USB um, cable. You can plug it right into like your iPhone um, adapter or whatever, and then it has its own cord to have like a wire um, connection to your phone or computer or whatever. Yeah, so I'm just using my iMac computer, so this is the input that I'll be using for that. That's pretty much it. It's real simple and standard. I just really like the sleek look of them, and they seem pretty lightweight, but but yet heavy duty, so it doesn't feel like you know super cheap or anything. And they kind of look kind of slick. I know they do have some all white ones that look pretty cool too. And um, I went with the black one since I knew I was just going to be using it for like, you know, business purposes. I probably won't take these out of the house at all. It's got some cushion around the band here. And there's the obvious cushion around the ears. They fit really tight though, so I will say that. My head is kind of, I guess, regular size head. Um, my husband would probably say it's a big head, but he always teases me that I have a big head. But 
I feel like I, you know, it's, I feel like these are kind of tight on my ears. So that would be the one thing I would say. But the recording, I did a voiceover wearing these to use the built-in microphone because I usually, that's usually how I do my voiceovers. I'll just put my Beats headphones on. But these record super crisp and clear. Like there's no humming, there's no feedback, there's no background noise. These are really good. So I like them for the work that I need them for. You guys can check them out if you like. It's Studio Regent. And I'll put the link in the description box. Morning, you guys. It's a new day. <laughs> I feel refreshed. I feel so much better today after getting a good night's rest last night. You know, drinking plenty of water. You know, lots of positive affirmations for myself. So I'm feeling pretty good today. I'm down here right now with Ann while she's having breakfast. I'm about to try to do a little something, something to her hair before I ship her off to therapy. My husband's in the basement doing his workout. But I just wanted to show you all how I am addressing Ann's hair this morning. Say good morning. See, I slept good too. Yeah, she slept real good. She didn't wake up at all last night, you guys. I've been working on this worksheet that I told you guys about. I believe I told you about this. I've been just kind of trying to collect data about her sleeping patterns and just kind of indicating when she wakes up through the night so that I can hand this over to her BCBA because she's trying to analyze Anne's sleep patterns in order to better address uh, strategies and things to help her. So I've just been trying to be really accurate in collecting information and taking notes about the things that are taking place throughout the night with Anne's sleep. <laughs> So I'm gonna, um, this is what I'm gonna do with her hair. I'm just gonna use um, this Cantu Edge product um, and a brush, and I'm just going to just touch up her edges a bit. We're still going with these twists. I didn't get a chance to take them down and wash her hair last night, but as the weekend approaches, I'll have more time to kind of do that. So I'm just gonna touch up her edges, put, a cute, put this in a cute little ponytail, and then she's gonna be on her way. <laughs> We're just gonna brush the edges, okay? Not too much, just a little. Just a little. Just a little, mommy. And then we're gonna wash your hair this weekend, okay? No. Okay? No. Yes. Well, okay, we're gonna put a little ponytail holder on it. Ready? One, two, three. All done. All done, Stink Sue, okay? Just a little something something. Just a little something, something. Okay. Okay. Just a little. Are you pooting? I, I, I hear somebody pooting, and I'm just gonna tuck this in. Tuck this into a bun so it's not like looking like little wormy worms, okay? Ready? Set, go! No more worms, yay! Burr, 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 burr. Cute! Cute, and Yep, dot. All done, all done. I don't think y'all have ever seen me in a bonnet. I don't usually sleep in bonnets, but I did last night because my hair was real, real dry. And it's time to moisturize and or wash and condition it. So I put this on just so I wouldn't cause any further drying out. <laughs> <clears throat> so I'm gonna go ahead and drop her off, get some things done today and what have you. So I'm gonna end this vlog here. I know it wasn't all that exciting, but you know, I'm just coming off of being sick. So what do you expect? So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.